Hi, this is Alyssa April with an AprilAday.com. Please check out my website. And I am here today to do a review for a projector. And this is a little bit more of a kid-friendly projector, um, something that you'd use to uh, blow up, uh, let's say, movies, TV shows they're watching, cartoons, um, even some video games that they're playing. You can project those up as well. It's a smaller projector and it's not super high quality, so keep that in mind. I would never use this in the classroom, but for, fun, for um, home use, it's great. Um, so that's kind of what it's more geared towards. Um, this is called FAVI Rio HD LED K1 projector. So I think I got that all out right. Um, it comes in different colors. I got the black and gray, which I think is listed as black. And uh, it also shows um, on the, the form that they had filled out for me to review this. Um, it shows that they have teal, pink, and white projectors. And I like those colors a lot. Um, I didn't see those on the pages where they're selling this projector. So the only option that I saw was the black and gray one that I have right here in front of me. Um, so that's something to kind of keep in mind if you're expecting those color options. On Walmart's website, this sells for $83.49 and on Amazon's website, it is $79.99. I will of course put the links on where to buy those at the end of this post so that you can see in case this interests you. Um, so you're not going to spend a ton of money, but also at the same time, you're not going to get a su super high quality uh, projector. Now, um, it does have HDMI and USB access, and then you can also plug it up, uh, plug in uh, into a stereo to get the sound. It comes with a lens cap, so that helps protect the lens. And I know, like for storage use, I will have the lens cap on. And um, up here, you can see when it's plugged in. I have the plug in um, plugged in right now. It's right here. This plug comes with the projector. And uh, you can see that when it's plugged in based on the light that shows. When it's unplugged, no light shows at all. You have to press it twice. To turn it on there we go actually I did three I don't think I hit it very well one of the times and you can see when it turns on based on that blue light that's showing through the lens um, and I did have to play with the source a little bit to be able to get it um, I wanted to project an image from my laptop I was watching the Americans and we watched it last night um, through this one downfall that I think um, is is that it's kind of a noisy projector. It blows a lot, and if I when I had my sound hooked in um, through it through the HDMI cable, uh, the sound wouldn't go through the computer. It would only go through the projector itself, and the noise wasn't the best. So that's another thing to consider. So if you're planning on having a party with a lot of kids or something and using this you'll want to have it hooked up to a stereo instead of just straight through. Um, and here's the sound. The sound th th this does come with the projector and this is how you plug in the sound to your stereo. We actually had to go buy a HDMI cable um, because it did not come with one. So that's something we did purchase on our own, but we figured we use it at other times as well. And what else does this come with? This comes with um, a remote for it. Um, I'm not sure why the remote is white and the projector is black and gray, as you can see. Um, so that's one thing that I was kind of curious about. But it is white and it looks like it's white with all the colors that it shows. So even with the pink and teal uh, projectors that they have shown on um, this page that I'm looking at. They um, still have the white remote control uh, offered. 
let's see and then the other thing that it comes with is a manual and the manual is not super thorough but enough that you can kind of see what to do and how to plug it in one thing it does recommend is to not use an, another plug-in um, for this than what comes with it so that if something happens to this one then um, you're gonna have to write the company and see if you can get another one so um, I did not see the name of the company listed on the projector anywhere as well as on the remote it's just not anywhere on there so I thought that was a little odd because we have projectors at work and the name of the brand is right on the projector and I think it's even on the remote this does come with a battery slot so it's two double two triple a sorry two triple a batteries my husband put those in there for me um, so you will need to supply those because it doesn't come with them and the quality of the video um, was just pretty mediocre it wasn't great but I also am coming from a design school where we have high-end projectors so I might be being a little critical for at home use is perfectly fine um, so something to kind of keep in mind well I think that wraps it up please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and I appreciate your time have a great day bye